Hello there, everybody. My name is Chatterack, and I am no longer sick. Uh, it's been a little while since I posted the video, and I truly apologize for that. However, I came down with a very bad summer cold. It just hit me out of nowhere. Uh, I was incredibly, incredibly nauseous. Um, I could not breathe. T I, throat just full of just gross mucus, and I it hurt every time I swallowed it all. It was really, really bad, and I don't normally get sick like that, so it really just hit me out of nowhere and out of left field. So I apologize for the lack of content, but I really couldn't make content since I couldn't breathe, so apologies for that. Um, but I'm back, and I'm, I feel great. I actually had to go to the doctor, and they were able to give me some medicine, which is something else I really don't like to do. I really don't like taking medicine. So I am pretty behind now <laughs> where I was and where I wanted to be as far as making content goes. So apologies for that in advance, but it gave me some time to reflect on my channel and you know, I was able to really write down some thoughts and ideas on some other things I want to do. Um, and I know I, I, I just, I want to be more honest with my own feelings. Uh, and what I mean by that is like, I don't mean that just as this YouTube personality chatter act. I, I mean it as me, as the chat inside the chatter act. That probably doesn't make any sense, but, um, I, you know, it's it just, over the time that I was, I, I was sick, I kind of, I, I came up with these, these ideas and these thoughts that, you know, whenever I get upset about the channel, or rather my content, or I guess me really more so, I have a lot of self-esteem issues with my channel, and what I mean by that is, like, I work, I you know, since I started this project three years ago of Chatterack, I have certainly come leaps and bounds from where I started, and one of those, you know, things is, is that I, I oftentimes get caught really ups getting myself upset when it comes to the idea of, you know, channel discovery, configuring the YouTube algorithm, so on and so forth. Um, and I oftentimes have tried to reach out to the YouTube heroes I oftenly talk about and refer to in my videos and content. Um, everyone who watches the channel knows exactly who I'm talking about and Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, you know, Boogie, all that, you know, all those guys. And it just, you know, I get to this point of I get myself incredibly worked up and I oftentimes feel the need to apologize to Game Tim more than anyone else because he gets it more than anyone and I just, he's the best friend anyone could ask for, but I often just get down on myself very easily uh, as far as, you know, I look back at the past three years and I sit there and I ponder and I wonder, you know, when, whenever I decide to stop making YouTube videos or, you know, whatever happens, happens, will I be able to look back and be proud of what I've done? And the answer is yes, because the chat I was three years ago when I started Project Chatterack to where I am now, it's totally different. Um, when I make YouTube videos, I feel great and I feel confident and I feel like, you know, I can do anything that I want to do. But I also know that at the same time, I could be doing so much more. There is still so much I could be doing, so many better things I could be doing to constantly make myself better, to make myself a better creator, to make more content that people are are happy with and will like and... It just, it, I get to these moments where I get very, I get so built up, um, just kind of looking back, because then I often do something I shouldn't do where I compare myself to other people, because I've had other channels that I've seen that are younger than mine with double the views or double the subscribers, and I, I, I let, I let those, those things bother me, and I let my jealousy just reign free, and... I need to stop doing that. I need to start being more honest with how I feel and exactly what my feelings are. Um, there's just so, there's a lot of things on my mind that happen like that. And 
often time, I end up venting it in all the wrong ways. So I apologize if this video sounds like, you know, I'm whining a bit, but there, there are things that I've had on my chest that I just, you know, that do bother me. Um, you know, like I said, you know, in three years time, am I proud of where I'm at? Should I be proud of what I've done? Are all of my accomplishments in nay or have they meant something? And clearly to me, they have meant something. I look around in this room of a studio now that I've built and I look at all the videos that I've made and I can see where I've come and what I've done and how, you know exactly how far I can still go. And you know, my last couple of vlogs, especially, you know, it's it sounds like all I do, I do is really, you know, compliment you guys. But that's because in the reality of the situation, you know, the the people who are loyal supporters of this channel really do a lot for me, whether they know it or not. And you know that constant need for inspiration the the willingness to move forward the things that i need to, the things that i need just to continue on and to make myself feel like i'm being a better creator because i have tons of ideas in my head but then when i sit down here in front of the camera or i sit down in front of my notepad and write notes down you know there are those days where, you know, things like, you know, jealousy, doubt, these negative emotions, they do they do surface and it can be hard to really deal with them and it can be really hard to, you know, exactly say what's on my mind. And and I, I oftentimes feel bad because I don't necessarily mean to put those feelings onto other people or onto someone else in particular. Because I do have my own problems. Everyone has their own problems. They have their own demons that they fight every single day. And a lot of the times they take advantage of me. And I often think I should stop doing this. I don't want to do this. I shouldn't be doing it. But out of all the things in my life that I've done, this is one thing that has... It filled me with a joy that I can't quite describe. I, I, I absolutely love recording and I love making content. And I love the you know the act the, the reaction and interaction that follow whenever I make a video. It's it's a it's a special kind of uh, of emotion that I have. I mean, even this shirt that I'm wearing right now, this is physical proof of that interaction with other people. Being able to see other people smile on the channel, laugh, play, etc., etc. That, to me, that is fuel. That is the fire that burns in my creative, passionate soul. And I, I just, I, I want to be more true to to me. And you know, like when I when I first started the channel, I knew there were the games I really wanted to play were horror games, and I knew about other games that I would like to do. But then as I started to create more and more stuff, you know, other flares pop and certain embers will glow. And you just really, you know, you want to keep the flame burning beautifully and alive. And I oftentimes struggle trying to find the right sticks and the right logs of wood to add to this fire because I have things like doubt and I have things like just raw emotion that really... Just God, they just they just get to me, and and again, and I apologize because I hope I don't subject anyone to it um, indirectly. Like I said, I, I I there are those people that I do affect it directly, and I always feel bad because you know I just I oftentimes feel like I don't appreciate or. Er, I oftentimes think I don't deserve the friends that I have. And I guess that is also part of that doubt that comes, you know, with it because my friends have, they do more for me than they will ever know as far as keeping me moving forward, supporting me and just everything that I do. And I just, I, I can't, I can't think that enough because it really is something special. 
that treatment that you guys give me as well as viewers, subscribers, family of the Chatterack, whatever you want to call it, it's just such an impact on my life that keeps me wanting to make more and more content and become a better creator overall. And, you know, I, I, with this vlog in particular, I really didn't want to do anything like jump cuts. I wanted it to be just pure, raw, thought o cheddar wreck. Um, and I, you know, I, I certainly, like I said, I had some inspiration while I was out sick to, you know, to make a video this way because I normally don't try to script my vlogs as it is, but I also will, you know, just kind of have an idea of what it is exactly I want to talk about. But, my main point was that I wanted to say is that, you know, you I, I don't have my heroes around to give me advice and to give me the inspiration I, I, I want or the really the guidance that I feel that I should have, whereas, whereas you guys come in as not just watchers, but as friends. And just, you really help me steer myself in the direction that I need to go. If I make a bad video, you guys are there to tell me what's wrong with it. When I make a great video, you guys are there to support it and tell me how, you know, much you liked it. You know, when I don't know what games to play, if I have an idea of what I want to do, you guys are always the first to suggest new things and try out other... I mean, the, the, the genre of games that I've played since making this channel has exploded in growth and it's really made me appreciate games more than I ever have before and I'll never ever ever be able to replace that emotion so I just you know wanted to make a video to basically sanctify this idea of my passion is still ever growing I am human so I have to deal with it in certain ways um, but as long as I have people like you, people like Game Tim, to, to keep me on the right path and to keep me constantly improving, I, to wake up each day and say, I'm going to make something better than I did the day before, and it's going to be awesome. Because I just, there are so many things I want to do with this channel. I just, I want to, I want to realize my dream and I will constantly fly to the sky to see that happen i will not give up so easily and it pained me the entire time i was sick not being able to make content because there were so many things i wanted to do in that that time frame and i i just i feel like when i skip a day of making videos that i'm just missing out on so much and it always upsets me it, it upsets me so bad and, you know, my birthday is coming up and I'm just, I'm not even excited for it because I just, I feel like there's more I should be doing and I should be focusing more on Chatterack. I've always worked so hard on it and this last year has especially been difficult with the channel, but I, I refuse to give up. I constantly want to know, want you guys to know that I am trying to be a better and better creator every single day I am constantly trying to basically put all of my being and all of my effort into these videos I don't want you just to be proud of Chatterack as the creator I want you guys to be proud of Chad as the person 100% me I have gained so much confidence from Chatterack and I want to be able to pay that back in tenfold so I just, I really just wanted to make a video to say that I'm back, I'm healthy, I can breathe, and I'll be making some more videos in the future, and that you guys just are every bit of important to this channel as the very games that I play on them. Without one or the other, the videos would not exist, and you guys have stuck with me and supported me to someone who I just don't think deserves it, but I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. I cannot wait to play games and make more videos with you guys soon. So, I really like this idea of just a 100% like completely just no jump cuts, just pure vlog. So, thank you guys again for watching. Please let me know what you guys think of, you know, me or the channel. I want to hear it pure, you know, straight from the heart. So, 
I cannot wait to play more games with you guys again, so I will see you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.